dear viewers assalamu alaikum today we are going to discuss the tutorial of material studio and uh, we will discuss that how we can make structure and uh, how we can calculate or analyze our structures and also the optimization of our structure so here we will create we can create an existing project we can open an existing project like here we have different projects or we can create a new project so i am going to create a new project so here we will save our file so here will be our project file like here we are going to make Okay, we will discuss that how we can make a structure and geometry optimization of our crystal structure <coughs> we have material studio 2017 version and uh, here is our detail of our project that either it is running or and here it shows the properties of our project and uh, this box is the description box which represents that our project is running and how much results are start time progressed are the status of our calculations so first we will open and from here we will open our window so the document may be the 3d atomistic <coughs> our text document grade or force field our study table so here we will open our this 3d atomistic and uh, now we are going to create our structure or build our structure for this we need that uh, uh, what module we are going to use so here we are going to use a step calculations <coughs> so this it can also be taken from here so here is the cast step tools and we can make calculations but before this we are going to build our crystal structure so here we will build crystal and uh, from here we should have some basic properties or parameters of the crystal which should which which should be known from and then we can make our crystal structure like here we are going to make titanium oxide so we will take this one so 136 p40 m and m and uh, here is the different groups of our structure if we don't know we can select that either we are going to take triclinic monoclinic or these are the crystal systems and latest parameters latest parameters represents that the three lengths and three angles so here we should know that what is the latest parameter of our crystal structure or what kind of parameters we are going to use so here i am going to make that is for a a b and c a and b is 4.59 angstrom a and b is 4.59 and c will be 2.96 like here it is alpha beta and gamma all three are 90 degree uh, it is from space group that we selected so it is already known that alpha beta
structure is tetragonal so in tetragonal structure all three angles are at 90 degrees the latest parameter we can check that our atom are special position within angstrom and orientation we can here select here that what is the orientation so we can also check this and calculate burning after build so we can calculate this one or ignore if we are going to ignore this then we will uncheck this one and ignore special position so apply now this is our box crystal structure now we will build and add atoms again go to build add atoms uh, now we can select atoms from here or we will select it from the table periodic table like here it is titanium with atomic number 22 and uh, name we can write here that it is titanium and here is the length of these three directions oxidation state don't need to mention you can see here is the temperature factor These fractional coordinates are 0 0.327 so 0 0.327 these are the fractional coordinates these are also known from the are going to add here again it is oxygen add now it is added so after this we can our display style so from here we can change the display style like here we can make it ball and stick model either like here or we can make it uh, larger balls with the we can we can select it uh, 0 0.3 or 4 size and the color color can also be customized color it is according to color by elements we can change color Here from this cursor we can we can rotate it like here like this so we can make it larger so now it is here we have we can rotate it or we can tra transition or we can fit to view <coughs> after this we can label our structure we can also uh, change the display style or display options lightning or labels by right clicking on the screen and after this we can change here that atoms we are going to label atoms font color we can select color and then we can color by charge element name now it is by element name and then apply or we can use element symbol we are going to remove we will check select the element symbol and then apply now it is by element symbol we can also change the color of our from here and now it so from here now we can 
energy minimize we can energy minimize or we can optimize the geometry of our compound and we have built our structure and after this we will go to a step or we can select modules from here a step calculations our analysis so here so here is our another screen from where we we can select that we are going to optimize energy or geometry optimization or dynamics so here we are going to geometry optimize here is the quality of our optimization it may be ultra fine fine or cars and uh, here is the functionals we can use different functionals and uh, here is our it remains as it is so from here we can use but we will spin polarized metal uncheck this it is not a metal it is metal oxide and don't need to mention here charge and then we can take this that if we are going to maximum iterations 100 and uh, from here algorithms which kind of algorithms are used and uh, okay now we can also go to properties population analysis we will uncheck it job control gateway location and job description so run in parallel on four cores of this optimized number of cores on the file so runtime optimization it should be default and then okay so these are the controls now we will go to more uh, from here electronics more so here we will set this is our basis for fine structure and uh, then here we can select our energy cutoff value so i am going to make it 400 so we can change these energies one by one and we can check that what is our cutoff energy and then k points from k points we can quality is fine separation then here is the grid parameter keep it as it is so dft studies so it will be like this okay and now we are going to make it run now our energy optimization is running so from here we can change the name of our project and it is now ready domestic as tip it is running and uh, now so this box represents that this is a running our software and now it is in a, in a geometry optimization is going to occur and after this we sometime we will get our graphs cutoff values and k points
okay it will take some time now here it represents that what is our job name geometry optimization and the cutoff energy value is 400 electron volt so we can minimize it close it we can again open it by here so this is the or dialog box from where we can open what we want to make it open or we can minimize our this data so from here like here it will be we can open these boxes again so here it represents status of our so geometry optimization it will give us so here are our energy values for optimization of this crystal structure after some time we will take this so we can use some other modules also and here we can we can also build so i am going to show you that we can also build polymers homopolymers block copolymers random copolymers or dendrimers we can we can build analogs of our structures nanostructures that is nanotubes nano ropes we can build transport devices and we can build meso structures like bead types so we will discuss uh, these type of other materials in our next videos uh, so here is our optimization so now our job is completed and uh, here is our results that represents that the energy cutoff values and are the other parameters so overall parallel efficiency so here is our results these are the energy convergence and these are our results for geometry optimization so number of iterations energy values and convergence so all these are shown here and this is our uh, geometry optimized so we can check at other parameters and then we can finalize it so in our next video we will continue our uh, geometry optimization and then uh, we will build other crystal structures also so thanks for watching my video.